Look at you. You do not look like you're ready to go outside, do you? You look too cozy and soft and warm. Welcome back to a new video and you guys have been asking for some more vlog stuff recently And I really haven't really had like the time to vlog very much, but I figured I'd do it today because Check outside Look how it looks. Oh, no, you can't see. There you go. It's so snowy Like well, I say it's so snowy if you actually live in a cold country You're probably like Claire that's not even a centimeter of snow, but it's still some snow So I thought we'd like go outside with the animals in the snow I don't actually know where all of it is, but I have some other animals with me right now We have little beanie here who actually got a groom yesterday, so she's looking so pretty. Like, look at her gorgeous ears, they got a little trim. We're really, really lucky with Evie because she like, she doesn't really have very long fur. Like, if you see some calves, they have such long fur, but Evie really doesn't. So we don't really need to get her groomed that often. And usually it's just like, show us your paw beanie. We just tidy up her paws so they're all like trimmed right down again, because otherwise all like brambles her, thank you. Thanks, baby. All brambles and stuff get stuck in them. And then we just trim like on her little tummy as well. So she's looking like, she's a bit confused about what's going on. Oh, you're tired. She's looking super, super pretty at the moment. It's probably not the best idea to go out in the dirty snow, but you don't get snow very often and I kind of want to see how you're going to react. So we'll bring you out in the snow. Is Darcy still in the kitchen? Yes. And then in here, on the kitchen counters where he's not supposed to be, we have little Darcerino. Hey, Baba, look how pretty you look. I actually don't think Darcy's gonna like the snow very much. He's a, he's a, like, it's weird. He used to go outside all the time, but he's such an indoor cat now. And he just kind of wants to spend the whole time hanging out with us. Wherever we are, he is. So I don't know what he's gonna make of the snow. Darcy, look at the camera. Are you being camera shy? There you go. Look how pretty you are. You even Evie's like, you're so pretty, Darcy. You're so pretty. And then Oliver, I think, is out and about somewhere. Look, the snow is like melting. It's all melting already. He's out and about somewhere. But I think when we go outside, he usually like hears us and comes running over and hangs out with us. Basically, whenever we go out, all the cats follow us. So I'm hoping he's gonna come. I was thinking maybe he would be like, he usually waits by the door there, but there's no sign of Oliver. Oh my gosh, I look so tired. Also, if you're looking at my teeth and thinking they look weird, I feel the need to point this out just because I'm really self-conscious about it. But look, can you see like here? I've got like these little attachments on all of my teeth. And I have to wear these retainers with them. They're like these clear retainers. And they're going to change the position of my teeth. But they're so painful at the moment. I don't have the retainer on, but when it's on, it's so sore. I only just took it out because I slept with it on last night. And my mouth is absolutely killing. But basically what it's going to do is like when I smile, you see how you can see gum on one side and you can't see anything on the other side? Basically, my mouth's not in love. Oh, hello, Beanie. Evie. There we go. We have Labine with us. Basically, when um, my jaw is like this, so it's not like a, it's not like level in my mouth. I never knew this. Like, literally, I never, ever knew this. Went to the orthodontist and he's like, yeah, your whole jaw's out of line. We'd have to, like, re... Like pull these teeth up and pull those teeth down and that's why I need like, and my bottom teeth need to move as well. And I was like to Ali like, how like how have we never noticed that my, my mouth is completely out of line? And he's like, oh I knew. I'm like, what? Why did you never say anything? When did you notice this? And Ali was like, I literally knew the first time I ever met you, the first time I saw you, I'm like, oh, her mom's out of line. But he didn't want to point it out because he thought I must know and be like self-conscious about it. And I'm like, I never knew the height of creepy mouth. Like, mm -hmm. look, I, ah, stupid gum. So hopefully it's going to take about four months and it's going to be really, really painful. And I'm going to have these little uh, strange things in for that whole time. Like, it's like, it's like my teeth are triangles. So hopefully it doesn't look too creepy, but... I just thought I'd tell you in case you thought I'd just eaten like rice pudding or something and then recorded a video and just had rice pudding all over my mouth and didn't know. I definitely know you guys and I know I look like rice pudding mouth. <laughs> so before we head outside, I was speaking to Freya who's Josh Zerka's girlfriend and she sent us some uh, Sidemen stuff. I think it's the new Sidemen leggings for girls. I haven't opened them yet. It's really nice of her to send them so I thought we'd check them out. I'm also aware that you guys have been asking. <laughs> this is the funny end. 
I'm also where you guys have been asking about my merch stuff. Beanie wanted to join us. I have like a design that I've started. It's a peach juice design. I think it looks really, really cool. And you guys like like the jumper option with the peach juice. So I'm gonna get cracking on that. I just haven't had time. And also, I don't know if you guys get this, but I, I slept really badly, like literally since I was in primary school. Like I can remember waking up in the night in primary school and like going into my brother's room and just being like watching him sleep because I couldn't sleep. And also like lying on the hallway so I could listen to central heating pipes. Weirdo, basically. And I still can't sleep very well now. Like I find it really hard to get to sleep. And I find it, look at this CD. I find it hard to get to sleep and I find it hard to stay asleep. And recently I've been really bad. And my general pro productivity for everything, if I can't sleep, is just awful. So that's why I've not been very productive recently. That's why videos have been out later, just because I've been so, I've been sleeping so badly. Especially going to New York and going to a different time zone. That's just made things like a million times harder. Okay, let's check out these leggings. Cause they look really cool. So I already have like my favorite leggings in the whole world around, which is like my little tartan leggings. But I thought I'd just stick these on over it. Hopefully they're gonna fit over. But I've seen the picture of them and I actually really like the side of my merch. I think it's like nice looking merch. I don't think they're gonna fit over. Give me one minute. <laughs> okay, I had to abandon my leggings. They weren't gonna fit on top. They're like skin tight. It was never gonna happen. I don't know what I was thinking. But Freya has just started her own YouTube channel. So I thought I'd give her a little shout out. And hopefully she's gonna make some really awesome videos. So, <laughs> After all that, here are the sidemen. How, how cool is their branding? Like, I just think their branding's so nice. And I like these leggings. I think they look pretty cool. I would like to do some of my own merch leggings, but maybe, maybe in time we can do something. Okay, I've just completely killed the coolness of the leggings by putting my cool mug socks on. But we are going outside and I'm really bad in the cold, so definitely need some nice warm socks for myself we also need something warm for this little bean some of you guys are, are say like oh it's cruel to put your dog in a coat you shouldn't put a dog in your coat like literally evie's cavalier king charles spaniel they're like a properly english dog so they can't really deal with like extreme temperatures she's not good in the heat look she loves these little ear nuggins you love the ear nuggins don't you bubba she's not very good in the heat she overheats really easily and she's not very good in the cold she gets cold so easily and one of the reasons is obviously look at her little tail go Going. She, she, uh, she's just been groomed recently, so it's gonna be even more so. But if I lift up her little paws here, and you look, like you can basically see the skin on her tum tum there. Like she's not gonna be able to protect herself against the the cold. She doesn't have fur. She has hair, and even like then, she has like. She has like quite short hair, so she gets cold really easily and she definitely, definitely needs a little coat. But luckily, I have this super, you guys have seen this before actually, it's like such a trendy little coat. And I think it's going to be pretty snow worthy, so we'll pop this on her for the snow. But the cat's followers, they ain't getting any coats because they've got a fur coat on already. Okay Levine, time to get your coats on my love. It's such a trendy coat, it's called Canada, Canada Pooch. I don't know if it's a play on Canada Goose. But don't, don't wear Canada Goose coats because they use real fur and it's horrible. Really sad, isn't it, Levine? Look how trendy you look. Oh my gosh, supermodel dog. Little supermodel. Look at you. You do not look like you're ready to go outside, do you? You look too cozy and soft and warm. Little baby. Oh my gosh, he actually looks hilarious. What, what are you doing, Levine? What are you what even are you? The cutest little baby in the whole world. And you totally know you are, don't you? You know you are. You know you are. Okay, there's no way I'm not. I'm gonna go outside without a big coat on as well, so it's time for me to get all warm and throw these Sidemen leggings better keep me warm. <laughs> so I've got a little Darcy Rooney. He does usually follow me down, but I don't know what he's gonna think of the cold. So I'm gonna give him the option because I don't wanna put him out in the cold if he doesn't want to. Even though, look at your coat, Darcy. You would never get cold, my love. Darcy. That's Papa. Come on, let's go outside. Look at Snowy. He always follows us, he's such a baby. I've got my snow boots on, like I am not getting cold. Oliver's coming as well. He has been out all day in the snow, but look at him. He looks like a little snow leopard. So I think he's fine. He's my baby, I love him so much. He came and chilled out with me for a while in bed last night, but the other night, literally, he came into bed, got under the quilts with me, and was like literally like that, like literally with his paws like that and his head there, and he stayed there for like 
haul of the like from like 6 a.m. to like 9 a.m. Scheduling up gorgeous. <laughs> So this one literally got a groom yesterday. Look at this behavior in the snow. Rubbing her beautiful clean ears in it. Evie, Evie, can you try not doing that, Bubba? Can you give that a go? What do you think? You hear all of it, by the way. And if you could hear him, but you just meows the whole time. Oh my God, you see that jump by Darcy as well. He's, try he's, he's stalking Oliver, look. Evie's gonna blow his cover now though. So it looks like a lot of the snow has actually melted already. It's like this is the entire thickness of all the snow. <laughs> so it's really not that much, but this is one of the reasons. It's, not, it's actually snowing now. I don't know if you can see that on the camera. This is one of the reasons why we wanna get a new house because we don't have a garden. So we have to kind of walk down our little lane here to this set of little, that's my mum by the way. <laughs> She's filming for me. She looks, look, look how cute she looks in the snow. You look like really warm and nice. And I've like decided to match Evie so we can both wear our red coats. But we have to come down here every time Evie needs a toilet, which when she was a puppy was a lot. Nowadays it's probably about three or four times a day. But it's pretty annoying not being able to just go into the garden if she needs to pee. So we definitely want to get a house in the garden and we can have some news for that pretty soon. And also some news on the Claire and Ali joint channel quite soon as well. And I actually think when I go back inside, I'm going to show you guys the peach juice design because I'd love to get your feedback on it. And I probably shouldn't like go any further with it until I know that you guys like it. But I'm a, I'm a bit disappointed with the snow, you guys. I'm not going to lie. There's definitely not that much. rice pudding so you'd have to get back inside now because I'm freezing. Look at this bun bun by the way, whenever you're outside he spends a whole time trying to go around your legs and be a little baby. Whereas Darcy is like, I am a wild cat. I am a wild cat in the grass. Look at him go. Such speed and grace and elegance. This is why the neighbours think we're mad by the way because every time we park we have this like little troop of animals that walks with us. Come on then weird animal gang. Let us return home. Come on, Darcels. Oliver's are in the lead. You need to try and catch him up. Go on. You got this. Can you guys see the snow in the air? I don't know if you can. I don't know if you can see it, but it's definitely snowing. Can you see it like falling through the air behind us? It is snowing, you guys. Ali actually sent me a video. He's in London filming and it's snowing even more there. And I'm a bit worried he might not be able to get home. Fingers crossed he can do. Get back inside into the warmth. Kitty cats. Come in. One, two. Where's number three? Oliver's like, open the door. Where's Darcy? There he is. Okay. You guys ready to go back inside into the warmth? Oh my gosh, I can't open the door. There you go. Look at that jewel cut ento enterage there. Beautiful, beautiful synchronization I saw. Oh guys, it's so cold. I just dropped my mum back off at the station. And the roads around here don't really get gritted or anything. And I obviously park next to Ali. I literally, as I was reversing, then my car did a little skid. And I'm like, please don't hit Ali's car. I already get nervous enough parking next to this. But I thought I would show you. Look at this, little icicles on Ali's car. This is a car that needs a garage, really. But I thought Ali would kind of appreciate some nice shots of his car in the snow there, looking oh, more white than usual. Looking really cool, actually. Beanie's actually loving the snow. <laughs> Oliver's followed me out again. <laughs> Oliver, is it a bit cold, Baba? What do you think? Look, I literally just parked my car a second ago. 
and the icicles are still there like they didn't come off for the whole time i dropped my mum off at the station that is pretty cold cold isn't it labine oliver's had enough of walking on the snow he's like on the melted bit at the side <laughs> such a little snow cat aren't you you're built for this lolly bear this is the only time he's really nice to Evie as well. When they're outside, he's so chill with her. Get inside the house and he's just like, nah, I want nothing to do with her at all. Not interested. Okay, Beanie, definitely back inside this time. It's meant to keep snowing for the whole of today, the whole of tomorrow, and maybe the whole of the next day. So I actually think like there's gonna get more snow. I'm gonna show you some pictures as well my mum sent me uh, from my dad back home in Harrogate and they've got four inches of snow there. Here we've not even got like, oh my God, so dark. Here we've not even got a centimeter, but they've got four inches because Harrogate's so much further up north. Like England's weird because like we don't really get that much cold weather, but we do kind of align with like the Nordics a little bit and they get a lot of cold weather. Okay guys, meow if you want treaties. Yeah, <laughs> that is two animals that definitely want some treaties. Darcy's literally on the counter like, get me the treaties, I want the treaties, I want them, I want them. You want them, don't you Darcy? Okay, down on, down on the floor, jump up here if you want them. Jump up here. Good boy. There we go. And then smart little well-trained bean knows that if she comes straight in and goes straight to her bed, then she gets treaties too. Good girl. You have to take this off you first though. Can't be eating treats with your coat on. Oh gosh, it's not easy to get off. Okay, let's get this coat off you. There you go. Good girl. So look at this, this is my parents house back in Harrogate, that's like at the front and you can see the snow there is, oh hello noisy feet, noisy feet over there, come sit up here, good girl, good girl, there you go, good girl. So you can see how much thicker the snow is there, ours looks like silly in comparison and then this is outside my parents back garden, look at that table, like I feel like I could lie in that and you wouldn't even be able to see me, I'd be just under the snow, but I'd be really cold so I, am, I ain't gonna be doing that. There's just one final thing I want to show you guys and I'm actually like, you guys probably know this is like Ali's setup room, this is where I used to record, I do all my recording upstairs but I actually still do all my old editing at my old desk here which is why sometimes there's pictures of two setups and if I ever like tweet pictures of the cats on my desk it's always here because this is where they hang out with me they don't come in my recording room because it's a little bit too small for them up there but I prefer having two different setups so if I'm recording stuff I can like export all those files whilst doing something on the other PC plus the other PC was just gonna be sat there going to waste so it's a good way for me to like split my like time between two different PCs and it kind of makes sense for me but a little, a little while ago I showed you guys this which was like my merch design stuff can't see it super well with me in it so I'm just gonna show you it here I showed you this in a Sims video I think it was but I kind of had like what started working on a few um, different like design stuff so this is like the little t-shirts designs there's these ones here and then there were these like peach juice jumpers at the bottom and you guys really really liked this peach juice jumper but obviously like that peach is just like it, I don't own that image like, that image isn't mine so I've actually been like on the hunt for illustrators I've got in touch with a few different ones and I found a girl in uh, South Africa weirdly enough that um, I really like the way that she designs stuff she does it in quite like a cutesy like almost like a, a kawaii a kawaii kind of way so I've been working with her on how do you make a glass of peach juice look cute and cool and kind of like my own style and we've been going back and forth for a little while and I think we've kind of finalized a few designs that I wanted to show you guys so please 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 let me know what you think of these in the comments below because your feedback is gonna be so useful okay here we go so we've got like st uh, the peach juice like cup and a little peach together I think they're super super cute I like I wanted to see what the cup would look like by itself as well though so I've got like just the peach juice cup here which I think is pretty cool as well like there's a little straw coming out and like a little peach like hanging out the top here and he's like such a happy little peach isn't it and then like the actual little peach itself as well and I think maybe for the top like we keep like um we have just the the peach juice and then the, the original design had like peach juice life like written here with the with the jumper that I showed you guys so maybe we do something like that and we have like peach juice life or something along the side I know it's a kind of like it's a little bit weird because it's like but if, if you guys know me you know how much I love peach juice and when I showed you guys that design you like you really really liked that one so I thought that would be kind of a fun one to focus on for the first thing not just like my big logo splashed over anything it's 
it's more like cutesy and like like if you if you watch the sh the channel then you get the joke kind of thing so it's kind of like something a little bit more personal with you guys because you guys will get it and hopefully you guys will think it's fun but it, it like it means something to us but maybe to everybody else it's just like oh they like this person likes peaches but if you know you know that's kind of what I'm thinking so if you guys like the design please please let me know in the comments below like I said like I'd really really value your feedback on this because it's like it's something that I find kind of hard to know what you guys are gonna like like I sometimes get it wrong with you guys and I want to make sure I get this right so please let me know in the comments below whether you would like that little cute design on a jumper or something just something a little bit fun and something like an in joke that we would get let me know if you like that idea and hopefully you enjoyed this little like a little mini vlog I just wanted to update you guys on some stuff to do with the house to do with the other channel show you guys the pets in the snow and show you guys that merch stuff so hopefully you liked everything if you want to see more little vlogs like this please let me know in the comments below and I'll see you guys in another video. Thank you so much for watching. Bye.